Hey guys, Annie Black here, and in this video, I want to talk about how to start a niche blog. So first of all, why would anybody want to build a niche blog? Well, a niche blog is a blog or website that's populated with content that is themed around a, spe a specific niche. Could be to do with plumbing, uh, uh, or dog grooming, or boxing, or mountain biking. Any topic that you can think of, even some really obscure ones, you can build a blog around. Now, the reason why you would do this is you can build a blog and over a little bit of time, you can start to get organic traffic from search engines such as Google or Bing. And that traffic can convert into income if people click things like ads or click on an affiliate product that might take them to Amazon or it may take them through to buy a course or a product from somewhere like ClickBank. Okay, so in this video, um, I don't want to touch on everything that you would need to do to build a blog, but I'm going to touch on one of the most important things, if not the most important thing, and that is content. Okay, no matter what niche blog you build, you are going to need content in order to do that. So what I want to do here is show you a new app that I've developed and you can head over to this uh, app, to this website. It's Rewriter app.com or you can click the link in the description and create a free account and what this app allows you to do is turn any existing article or content piece into a completely new article or content piece and the great thing about this is the quality of a content is just as good as the original and I'll explain why and how that is in a minute um, but not only does the content read perfectly um, it is also completely unique in the eyes of Google and the other search engines and that is because it will share zero footprint with the original article or content. So let me give you uh, an example of this. So I'm actually logged into um, the paid membership here, okay? Um, but the, the concept and the process of the rewriting um, is exactly the same as with the free account. So you can rewrite articles exactly the same with the free accounts that I'm giving away. So let's just uh, click on one of these um, projects here. Let's click on hypoallergenic fur because this is one that I've actually rewritten. So I'm going to click view. And what you can see here is the article that I've pasted in. The uh, software has passed that into many different individual sentences. In fact, there are 33 sentences. Some of these are very short. Some of these are like little subheadings. Some of these are a little bit longer. But the idea behind this uh, concept and this software is it's so much easier to read one sentence and paraphrase that sentence so that it is worded differently but retains the same meaning. I'll give you an example. Um, so here, um, so this is like a, a title or a, the heading of a site. So the second sentence here is, are you a dog lover? And the written sentence to this is, are you someone who loves and adores dogs? And this next sentence is, do you live in an apartment or small home? And the rewritten sentence is, are you residing in a modest size home or restricted condo or apartment? So what you would do is you would simply fill in these blank text areas here, okay? And you would um, basically rewrite each sentence. Um, now I've actually just noticed, I've just literally be fit, been fiddling on with the code and I've forgotten to remove something. Hence why it's got these little slashes here. So I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to go in after this video and just fix that. It'll only take me a minute. Anyway, getting back to the point. So what you would do is you would basically rewrite each sentence and then go to the next one. And if you notice here, it actually tells me the uh, similarity um, percentage in the form of a bar, okay, a colored bar. If it's green, it means it's, um, you know, unique enough. But the idea with this is you not only reword it, you also uh, change the structure and also um, reverse the sentence as such in, in a lot of these cases. Um, I'll try and see if I can give uh, an example of that. Like this uh, sentence, for example. So we have here, grooming isn't a worry with this breed, even with Havanese, that's a breed of dog, by the way, um, that are shown in competition. And then in here, we say, even though the Havanese are widely known uh, uh, as show dogs, and competing shows, grooming them is never an issue. So what we've done here, we've kind of flipped 
this part of the sentence and mention this first and then this part of the sentence we've mentioned it towards the end so we've reversed it but by doing that we've basically paraphrased the entire sentence making it completely unique okay now um so we, we basically work through each uh, sentence like this okay and Every 90 seconds, the app will refresh and resave anyway. But as you can see here, it tells us the new article word count is 641 uh, words. The original word count was 505. So the rewritten article, even though it retains exactly the same mean meaning, is actually a beefed up version. It's better than the original because it's got more content. It's got more words, okay? Um, it tells us a completed census here. So this is basically just to monitor your progress. So we can see it's 100% it's done. So if as I'm working throughout this, if this refreshes or if I click this button here, um, this will basically increase to just give me an idea of how much of the project I've rewritten and how long could I expect it to take. Now, normally for me, about a 600 word article would take about 20 minutes. So it's not very long at all. And a good thing about this is it requires zero research i don't have to go and research topics i don't have to get an entire article or, or piece of content read through it understand it digest it and then have to sit down and rewrite uh, you know the concept of the article from scratch because all i do here is sentence by sentence and the good thing with this is certainly with the paid membership is i can come back anytime i want so if i've got a large article say there's a 200 words of content that i want to rewrite I can do that in, you know, as and when I want. If I want to spend 10 minutes on it, I can do 10 minutes and then come back later on that day or the next day and finish it. And after a little bit of work, that whole project is going to be complete and I'm going to end up with, you know, 2,000, 2,500 word article that reads perfectly well. Google will love, it will likely rank and um, the readers are going to enjoy it. People who are going to read the article are going to enjoy it because it's real quality content, okay? And then uh, underneath here, it gives me the overall uniqueness. Um, now, you might think 57% um, isn't that high. Actually, every single part of the article is completely unique. What this kind of monitors is the similarity. But because we're rewriting a content piece, you can expect it to be around this sort of mark anyway, because the idea is it, it needs to be on point with the original article. That's why we, we are rewriting it. And then underneath here as well is the rewritten article. So what the app does is it, um, collates all of the re rewritten sentences and then forms them in a brand new article, okay? And puts all the um, paragraph breaks in as well. And then all we do then is we just click copy um, article and then it copies it to the clipboard. Something else I do want to show you though is um, the uh, synonyms. Now we've got a built-in thesaurus, okay? So if I tip, uh, click on like allergies, for example, you can see here it comes up with allergens, sensitivity, asthma, eczema, allergic, um, we put here dog, it's come up with hound. Um, let's have a look, fur, um, pelt, mink, sable, leather, hair, um, answer, respond, reply. So the great thing about this is if you're um, going through and basically rewriting an article, part of that is by changing the words, okay? So we don't wanna be using the same words, um, like here, for example, alertness. It's come up there with vigilance, watchfulness, attentiveness, okay, awareness, preparedness. So we, if we're rewriting this sentence here, we might not really want to be using the words, you know, very sharp alertness. So we would want to change one of these words and rather than spending, you know, 30 seconds pondering, trying to think of a word that's similar, which is called a synonym, what we can do, we just click that and instantly get up to six synonym, synonyms. Like here, we've got activity, click on that. Activeness, action, bodily function, right um body process uh qualities traits characteristics attributes virtues abilities strengths so it's really really handy just to be able to click on any of these words in the original sentences and get served up with some alternative words that we can use that's going to help make our sentence more unique um so basically that's a quick overview of the app okay it's very very good if you use this process, this concept, you're always going to end up with really good quality content that's great for, for your visitors um, and they're going to enjoy that, which is going to have an effect on your rankings as well in the search engines. Google's going to love the, con the content, Bing's going to love the content, and you, your readers are going to love the content. Now, um, the good thing with this is, again, you don't need no research in time. Um, you don't have to think of your own topics. There's lots of PLR content um, that you can use. In fact, if you actually... 
um, sign up to my paid membership. It's only seven dollars a month, and you get um, access to all of these features. So you can, if you do writing work for clients, and um, you can add clients, you can delete clients, you can set pricing because it'll automatically price up re uh, writing jobs. So if you want to create some articles for um, clients or write for any other blogger or business, you can do that, and you can get paid. And it'll calculate those costs for you. Um, and you will be able to access the you know the thesaurus that's built in everything that I've just shown you there and you can also um, work on up to 30 different projects at any one time okay and you can delete the projects and um, just by clicking delete and then confirming it or you can view a project and you can also access um, 15,000 PLR articles now these are across hundreds of different niches and the quality of these are really, really good articles. They're well written, like they're professionally written. They're not spun articles. So you can basically, um, you know, choose a niche from the, from this pack here, grab some articles that you um, like the look of, and then you can pop them into a rewriter app, rewrite them, and then build a niche blog based on that. And then once your site's sort of embedded in, in you know, in the search engines a bit, you, you start to see some rankings, you start to see some traffic, then you can start thinking about maybe adding some ads into your content as well, um, whether that's a WordPress plugin or something like that, and then basically monetize your blog. But the main thing is the first thing you need is content, and this app here um, will give you that, and you can get a free account if you click the link in the description. Be sure to check out the paid membership though. Again, it's only $7 and see whether it's for you or not. But thanks for watching this video and I hope to see you on the inside. <music>